Strange name. Our next singer's band had a name that was truly out of this world. Once heard, never forgotten, it's Suppose, Carol Decker. Suppose's first album sold over five million copies. China In Your Hand was the longest running number one of 1987. It has featured in over 150 compilation albums. Carol Decker had her road to Damascus moment whilst watching an episode of Star Trek featuring the Vulcan High Priestess Suppose. It was 1987. Unusually, their debut single, Heart and Soul, was first a hit in the US before making it into the charts in the UK. Well, that broke for you, not over here, but in America. What do you think that was? If there is a theory, I can only ever put it down to it's the home of rap, and that was my feeble attempt at a rap. The American public took the song to their hearts after hearing it in a jeans commercial. To Poe's debut album, Bridge of Spies, exploded onto the scene. The band was on its way, and the lineup could now afford even more beaten leather, chains, and hairspray than Cher could ever dream of. Their second big hit came with China in Your Hand, the highest selling single of 1987. Number three for uh, number, no, number one. one. For three weeks. Five weeks. Over the next six years, Tupou and Carol Decker shifted over four million records. And now she's back. Hitting us one more time with China in Your Hand, she's live. She is Carol Decker. A superb voice, but what gave you your big break? Uh, America. It was uh, Casey Kasem and his lovely Pringle jumpers. We were doing really well in America, but not so well over here. And he had to bring me to everybody's attention, and that was the start of it. Yeah. Well, as well as yourself, the Pringle jumpers caught on as well. Ooh. Not in my house. <laughs> <laughs> now, a little later on, uh, you're going to do a track that was chosen by your daughter. What is yeah, it? Yes, Scarlett. Hello, darling. Scarlett, pick this for me. It's Superstar by Jamelia. Yeah. Fantastic, look forward to it. Carol Becker, everyone! 